Hello everyone, how are you? It's Miss Richardson here. Today I wanted to make some soup and I was hoping that you could help me to make it. It's not just an ordinary soup, it's a silly soup. So for my silly soup, I wanted um, to use things that begin with dysphonium. Can you tell me what dysphonium is? K, it's a k phonium. So I only want things in my soup that begin with k. Can you think of anything that begins with k? Hmm. I think cake begins with k. And what else? Carrot begins with k. Coffee begins with k. Hmm. Can you think of some more? So here, I've got some things that are going to go in my soup. And I want you to help me to find out if they begin with k. Okay, so what do we have first? A crab. Okay, we have cow and a car and a pear what's this a ball and a carrot so usually when we play silly soup at school I would get you to tell me one of the objects which begins with k but today I can't hear you, so we're just going to go through them one by one and we're going to figure out which ones can go in the soup, okay? So when we're um, stirring our soup around, we're going to say a rhyme and hopefully you'll have heard it before and I want you to do it with me, okay? So it goes like this. We're going to make some silly soup. We're making soup that's silly. We're going to put it in the fridge to make it nice and chilly, okay? So, hmm, what shall we put first in the soup? What about the car? Does car begin with the phoneme k? Car. Yes, it does. So we can put this in the soup. We're going to stir it round and say our rhyme. We're going to make some silly soup. We're making soup that's silly. We're going to put it in the fridge to make it nice and chilly. What else is going to go in the soup? Can you tell me? What about the crab? Does crab begin with k? Crab. Yes, it does. In you go, crab. We're going to make some silly soup. We're making soup that's silly. We're going to put it in the fridge to make it nice and chilly. So what about the ball? Does ball begin with k? Ball. No, it doesn't. It, what does ball begin with? It begins with b. Ball. So we don't need the ball. What else could we put in? What about the cow? Does cow begin with k? Cow. Cow begins with k. So we can put it in. Are you ready? We're going to make some silly soup. We're making soup that's silly. We're going to put it in the fridge to make it nice and chilly. So we've got left the carrot and the pear. Which one of these begins with k? Carrot. Carrot begins with k. And pear begins with, you tell me? P. Okay, well done. So Carrot is in the soup. I'm going to give it a stir one last time. We're going to make some silly soup. We're making soup that's silly. We're going to put it in the fridge to make it nice and chilly. So our k soup, all ready to go chilly in the fridge. Okay, shall we do another one? Take those out, get my bowl back. So this time we're going to make soup with Objects that start with this phoneme. What is this phoneme? It's s. So, here's my things that begin with s. Let's see what we've got here. What is this? Spoon. Do you know what this is? A seal. Starfish. We've got puzzle, hammer, and who's this? Sky. So, what shall we put in the soup first? What about this spoon? Does spoon begin with s? Yes, spoon does begin with s. Yeah, let's give it a stir. We're going to make some silly soup. We're making soup that's silly. We're going to put it in the fridge to make it nice and chilly. What's next? Hammer. Does hammer begin with s? Hammer. No, it doesn't. OK, 
don't want hammer in, in our silly soup today. What about the seal? Does the seal begin with seal? Yes, then we go seal. Okay, we're going to make some silly soup. We're making soup that's silly. We're going to put it in the fridge to make it nice and chilly. And what about starfish? Does starfish begin with s starfish? Good. Okay. We're going to make some silly soup. We're making soup that's silly. We're going to put it in the fridge to make it nice and chilly. So now we've got sky and we've got the puzzle. Sky puzzle. Which one begins with s It's sky, isn't it? And what phoneme does puzzle begin with? It begins with p, isn't it? P. So we don't want we don't want that in our silly soup today. So we've got sky in our soup. We're going to make some silly soup. We're making soup that's silly. We're going to put it in the fridge to make it nice and chilly. So our soup is all ready. Shall we do another one? Yes. Let's see what we've got this time. So, which phoneme do we have here? It's the d phoneme. D. So we're going to find things that begin with d. So here we have a dog. Digger. A dinosaur. A monkey. And a boat. Okay. So, which one shall we put in first? The dog? Does dog begin with d? Yes, it does. There we go. Ready? We're going to make some silly soup. We're making soup that's silly. We're going to put it in the fridge to make it nice and chilly. What else? Monkey. Does monkey begin with d? Monkey. Yes, it doesn't. What does monkey begin with? It begins with m. Mm. So, there you go, monkey. Dinosaur. What does dinosaur begin with? It begins with d. D dinosaur. So, need to stir in our silly soup. We're going to make some silly soup. We're making soup that's silly. We're going to put it in the fridge to make it nice and chilly. So what about digger? What does digger begin with? D -d digger. So, oh, if it will fit in our soup, a bit full. We're going to make some silly soup. We're making soup that's silly. We're going to put it in the fridge to make it nice and chilly. And the last one, boat. Does boat going to go in our d soup? Boat. Right. What does boat begin with? B. Begins with b. Okay, so our d soup is all finished. And I think we'll do one more. Here it goes. And our last phoneme is, what's this phoneme? Okay, so we're going to find things that begin with t to go in our soup. So we have grapes, turtle, what's this? Tiger, tambourine, and a fire truck. So which one of these begins with t? What about turtle? Turtle begin with t. Yes, it does. So there we go. Ready? We're going to make some silly soup. We're making soup that's silly. We're going to put it in the fridge to make it nice and chilly. So what about the grapes? Are the grapes going to go in our t soup? Grapes. No. What do grapes begin with? G. So uh, what about tiger? Tiger. Yes, tiger does begin with t, doesn't it? Okay, we're going to make some silly soup. We're making soup that's silly. We're going to put it in the fridge to make it nice and chilly. So now we've got fire truck, fire engine and tambourine. Which one of these begins with t? It's the tambourine, isn't it? What 
What does fire truck or fire engine? What does it begin with? It begins with a f, doesn't it? So let's not go in our soup today. Let's give it one last big stir. We're going to make some silly soup. We're making soup that's silly. We're going to put it in the fridge to make it nice and chilly. There we go, our soups are all finished. So we we did four thinnings today. We did and d so well done we did four phonemes so you could play this game at home if you like so if you've got a bowl and a spoon you could play silly soup or you could just look for things around your house and then also you could find a soup a spoon in the kitchen and say S spoon and you could look for um if you have a toy um in your bedroom like a ball you could find the initial phoneme ball it's a book isn't it um, or you could even look outside and say the phonemes for things that you can see so the sky um what phoneme does sky begin with it begins with s so you could do that you could say t for trees d for grass and just see what you can find okay so i will see you soon and we'll play some more games thank you bye, -bye.